This intelligence data site was built as a prototype for large-scale decision support tool for determining electrification strategies in different geographical areas of Lamo district. Sunbird AI used remote sensing datasets, including the open buildings and several means of energy and mineral development datasets. We try and calculate where buildings are, that's one area. We try and calculate where roads are, we try and calculate uh, a proxy for where people are. We also try and calculate based on the buildings, the sizes, the location, the density, what, um, what activities are taking place. And this can be obtained from these, but also we add other factors. So for example, what does the vegetative index look like? Well, how much vegetation is there? And this is a proxy for biomass. We try and understand you know, how much solar energy is there. And by combining this sort of power demand side and the power supply side, we try and estimate what would be the most appropriate electrification strategy for a particular district. The application analyzes the demand and supply side of electrification and now the Ministry of Energy and Mineral Development says this is to be carried on in the implementation of the National Electricity Strategy. We apply mini grids in places where we think extension of the grid at the immediate may not be financially viable. So the pilot we've done in Lamo was to do a proof of concept for us to understand that we have a platform that can help guide the distribution, the siting and development of these mini grids. So certainly we want to scale out this across the country. We want to use this uh, platform to show where else we can site these mini grids and how best we we'll develop them to be productive. Sunbird AI is an organization focused on developing artificial intelligence solutions for the social good in the African context and this project was funded by GIZ. Samuel Senono, UBC News.